What's up everyone, here's Phantom. In this video I'm gonna teach you and show you how you can make your Shokobo, your companion, fight with you. And when you're doing like the quests in the open world. Like I always need like to do like some uh, side quests to have this ability for him. But it's pretty cool, so you're gonna be able to help a lot in the fights. So it's not gonna make a lot of difference in your, in your combat, but... It's cool because normally when he's, he's if he's walking with you, he um, he can help you attack the enemies or he call attention. Because if you don't have this quest, he not was not able to be walking with you. You're gonna show up only when you summon to uh, or fly with him or with the using him like the horse. I don't know how we, uh, the word we can use with that, but it's basically yeah. So. I'm gonna show you how step by step how you can do that. It's very pretty simple. Uh, don't have a mistake. This was more easy. This is gonna be more easy than the, the how to unlock him the first time. Complete fate. So we're now gonna show you guys how you can do the uh, the location for the mission and the mission itself to teach your chocobo fight so the location will be the black shroud you're gonna be in the south shroud you're gonna be right here see camp turn kill this is the be location you're gonna get a quest for your chocobo let me uh fast travel there Okay, once we're here, the person who's gonna give the quest for you, uh, I did already, gonna be this guy here, or this lady. Here. They is who gonna give the quest for you, and the quest will be, let me close this, you know, uh, completed, side quest, Grandia, is a quest on level 30, this here. My feisty little chocobo. You're gonna get this quest, okay? And then you need to go to the central shroud. There is where you're gonna do the quest to teach your chocobo to fight. So, we're here in the south. If he's good, we fly there. Um, let me teleport. So, let's go to central shroud be right here this is where you're gonna do your uh, quest for chocobo let's uh, teleport there once you get the quest don't forget my fight little chocobo and then you teleport to central shroud so once we're here now in the central shroud once you're here you're gonna come here. You see my Chocobo here because I have the quest completed, right? So he'll be able to walk with me. If you know, he will, I'm gonna walk by myself and I'm gonna use him on his amount. So you're gonna come here. When you come here, you're gonna talk with this guy here. I did this quest already, so I'm not gonna show up a lot for me. But the next step for this quest, you're gonna come this location here with your chocobo you see these greens here these will be the greens you're gonna use to summon your chocobo to he walk with you so is this item here guys so greens this is the item you're gonna need to summon your chocobo I can show you here let me uh, send back my chocobo uh, right here Okay, so once you complete that, you get the greens, you're gonna come back, deliver the, uh, complete the quest to him, and here you're gonna show you how you can summon your chocobo. You're gonna get, you're gonna get to use the item, right here. And you show up. 
So your Chocobo always going to stay in the screen here in the top for half hour. You can stack max two to be one hour with you. If you don't want him walk with you anymore, just pass uh, withdrawal. He's gonna go back, but this time he's gonna lose. When you bring him back, you're not gonna have the time anymore. So after the, the quest, I'm gonna show you how to use your Chocobo gonna be out here, walk with you. You're gonna need to kill enemies as a train. Let's mount. So the train is gonna be here. I'm flying here, I'm gonna show you these guys later. You're gonna be in this location. But everybody make a mistake coming here. Because it's gonna show like a red circle, so you need to kill the enemies with your Chocobo. But it's not here, it's above you. So when you come from there, You need to go up. You're gonna come from there. You're gonna go up here. You're gonna come here. Come here. And here where you are, where you're gonna kill the enemies. They're gonna be around here. If I remember, we'll be exactly one here. Get off and then you're gonna kill i believe i think it's three of them your yeah, chocobo are gonna help actually but i just i'm too strong i give i'm a level 62 when the enemy is level 30 so they die once you complete uh kill the three uh the creatures need uh, i don't know i remember how many is it's three or five or four i don't remember you're gonna be able to you need to go back there and talk with the guy again I'm just flying because I can't fly now, so it's more easy. So we're gonna go back here. We're gonna talk with him. You're gonna complete the mission. So this will be your fight, uh, your, your little fight. Chocobo gonna be able to walk and fight with you in the missions. Also, since he uh, he's, he's your companion to fight now, you're gonna have his own page. So you come here, companion. So he have his own. HP system, XP system now. Here is the rank he are. Here is the HP bar. So I, I need uh, 82,000 to go to the next level. I'm level rank 3. Here's the items to summon him. Withdraw. We can put like this like shortcuts here if you want. This is the one you can use. Uh, free stance, def uh, defender stance, healer stance, attacker stance, and follow basically on the skills here's your skills area you have defender healer attacker every time you rank up you're gonna receive scp points the scp points you're gonna push purchase the skills you want for him i'm focusing my one in first attack so every time like you rank up you're gonna receive the exact amount of points here so here the next one next one i'm gonna be i'm gonna receive a five four points I can use here or I can use for any other one so I'm gonna focus on this first appearance you can buy buy and earn clothing for your chocobo here so we have we have head body and legs once you click here you have a different ones you can see right here when change you can you don't need to be the same set you can mix them put this one here put this one so you can mix all the set for your Chocobo. You can buy with real money fund in a Muggle a website if you want, or you can uh, uh, earn or buy in the board market too. Uh, where's the other one I use? Because I like Max. You can see Max face. Okay, it's so adorable right here. Actually, this is kind of princess. I should I keep another one? This no. Uh, let me do this. Let me keep this one. I need to find a better one for him. Yeah, so once you have a Chocobo, this is how you do to teach your Chocobo fight. Um, the item you need to use the this one here, the Gashu Greens. You can buy any place. It's not base. It's not any place. It's, it's a certain place they sell this. Uh, the basic location I found. 
the they sell this item for uh, you be, be able to zoom your chocobo was in uh, let me go here you go here Lanoskia then you go Lemonas Lemonas lower decks here here's where I found to buy the greens let me go there it's kind of expensive to go there but it's not expensive the item so it's all good And here we are. Here you're not gonna see a chocobo because this area you cannot summon your compan companion, your mouse. You cannot summon them here. So here is the location that I found. They sell these items. So uh, let me go. Where is he? Because so many people. I, I think it's there. Let me just confirm if he's here. If I remember, he's here with this person here. Yeah, is you? I think it's you. Okay, buy items, purchase items. And uh, here we are. You have the item here. It's, 30, it's 36 gills per uh, per piece, for unity. So you can buy this one here. And just feed your Chocobo to be able to summon him to he'll walk with you and level up. Uh, how other question thing is, how you can level up your Chocobo? You're gonna join Fate. Is how we're gonna jo uh, help your chocobo to level up. Uh, have a, a challenge uh, log. We have your challenges for the week. So normally put a ch uh, challenge for you to do it and for your chocobo. So here, have here. The blue XP sign is for your chocobo. So this was mine. A kill 20 enemies, uh, the semi level. When it means semi level, it cannot be you. Le I'm level 62. My Chocobo is level similar to mine, and we kill a, a creature level 20. Not gonna count because it, will, it must be the semi or close level. So you need to do it this in phase because in phase they lock uh, the level. So they're gonna they're gonna level uh, not level up. How it um, you're gonna sink the level. So you got you your Chocobo and your uh, enemy is gonna be basically the same level, and then you kill them. And then the count goes. My I got 20 kills, and then I need, I need 100. So I get 4,100 XP for him, and after that, 8,200. Okay, this is one of the best ways to uh, make your Chocobo um, level up. Other, the location where it was before doing the quest for the Chocobo, you can let him sleep there, and people can, other players can feed him while you're not there. Gonna help. Also, he level up is what I read because uh, read, you need to have apartments to do that to be able to hire the type of service. Yeah, I don't have it, but I read that online. I'm not 100% if that's correct. But the one I'm following, you do like uh, fights in the open map and fades and this uh, challenges for uh, the challenge log is helping level up my Chocobo. So that's it. That was pretty easy too. It was not, not that difficult. Next video, I'm going to show you guys how you fly your Chocobo. Is much more simple than all the other two ones. And if you guys like, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe to help me. And the little cloud here, we need, to, we need to feed this little cloud here. He's right here. He don't want to talk to me. He look at the lady there. I think he like her dress. Maybe he think like he's she's, uh, she's Tifa maybe. Uh, if you like the video, like drop a comment below and tell me what if you like the video, what I need to improve in the video, what uh, questions you have, what video you want me to make. If you have a question about like a, a crafting, like how make more money, how to level up a certain thing. If I know how to do it, I'm gonna make a video for you, definitely. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter and Instagram to have a contact with me. Uh, follow me on Twitch to see what th next time I go live and i don't mind at all answer the questions you want because we have a lot of new players i'm a new player i'm playing this for uh, basically 10 days we have like a few hours each day but basically 10 11 days i'm level 62 but i'm still learning a lot so a lot of content i'm making i'm searching a lot to learn how to do it and make the video to help new players coming like me so stop by the stream let's have, have a chat have fun and uh I help you, you help me, everybody like goes together. The Final Fantasy Online community is very like um, 
welcome. This is one of the most game I've like I never experienced that. They very like people are very nice in this game. It's not toxic. And if you're like a new player doing raids or uh, dungeons, you just talk in the chat with them and they explain for you everything that is all good. It's so cool. But anyway, I hope you guys have a nice weekend. I hope to see you guys next video. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to subscribe. See you next video. Bye. Say bye, Cloud. Cloud is always quiet. You know, I would like to talk. Well, see you guys.